It is a good thing that you have decided to deal with procrastination by listening to this audio. Of course, if you have procrastinated, you won't be listening here right now. Yes, it is true that procrastination is not easy to deal with. I understand that it is also very tempting to listen to the first audio in this series and then listen to the others later. Unfortunately, later always turns into the present. And as we feel the pinch of the present, we try to come up with another later to make ourselves feel better that we will get things done eventually. This disruptive cycle continues until we run into serious problems involving broken relationships, lost income opportunities, or even death through sickness. It is indeed very scary to think about the destructive aspects of what the effects of procrastination can have on oneself. The interesting thing about procrastination is that procrastinators aren't born. They are, in fact, made. What's the difference between a successful person and a procrastinator? The successful person has learned to deal with procrastination. So, in essence, every single one of us are procrastinators. So, why do we procrastinate? Really, it comes down to one very simple reason. We don't want to do it. The solution lies in convincing your mind that it is pleasurable to do those things we are avoiding. The only difference between a highly successful person and a heavy procrastinator is that the first one knows how to deal with procrastination more effectively. That's it. Overcoming procrastination is something absolutely anyone can learn. In the next audio in this series, we'll get started. We will identify the three major types of procrastinators and how to begin to overcome procrastination. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.